Hi, my name is Eric Yang, and um, before I get into my app, I'd like to talk to you about your photos, uh, more importantly, your photo viewing experience. Right now, if you're like me, your photo viewing experience is mainly Snapchat. You just take a glimpse of a photo or video for like 10 seconds, and then it's gone. That's not what photos used to be. Photos used to be something that you have forever, and you might go to your parents' or your grandparents' house, and they have these big tomes, photo albums, and you look through that, and you, know, you kind of get lost in the past for a little bit and you sort of soak in life for a little bit and that's kind of what I want to recreate in my app um, it's called our photos because I want it to be something much more personal so this is the app so far um, the main idea is that I feel like there's um, sort of photos have some sort of power that most apps aren't tapping into and that power that I'm talking about is like it can make you really nostalgic happy very emotional and to the point of where you start crying and I want that to happen when you come to my site. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I want it to be a very sentimental thing. And um, I thought the best way to do that was to uh, recreate a photo album, like a, like a book, and in a way that you can arrange the photos wherever you want it to be and make it very personal. Um, what would happen is that you would sign in with your login account and you'd be able to access all of your albums and your albums would have certain tags like wedding or beach or baby photos, whatever it is. And if depending on which tag you choose, it would then um, render a SoundCloud API with a playlist attached that associated with that tag. So as soon as you hit your album uh, page, it would start playing music that's in the same theme as your album. So if you pick wedding to be your theme, then you would it would play some wedding music. Beach would play something like Bob Marley, like uh, <laughs> So that will be playing in the background when you're flipping through your photo album book. Yeah, yeah, got all these tropical pictures, and you'd have Bob Marley playing in the background. And you know, it can zoom, it can hover over mouse, it zooms in. I haven't gotten all the functionalities down yet, but um, I certainly have this book at least and the music put together. Uh, yeah, and so of course you need to add some photos, and that took me a while, but uh, for now you can add just a photo one photo at a time and if you submit it it should <coughs> pop up in the next page oh, crap. there you go there it is so you just submitted a photo you can do it again and it should add to your photo book there you go and at the same time, of course, you can listen to music. Um, yeah, in the future, I want to definitely make this, this is a very um, user experience focused product. So obviously, I have to change the design of the web page. Um, I have to change how these photos interact um, uh, in terms of sizing and where they're located. Um, I definitely want you to be able to upload your entire photo album from your computer. And then it would then save it onto the server, which would then have a, I want a sidebar that has all your photos and a little thumbnail of all your photos and you can like drag and drop into place in your photo album. I want that to be um, a feature in this app in the future. Uh, and yeah, in the end, your experience is gonna be something like this, where you go onto this site, music is playing. <laughs> Enjoy this app. Thank you for listening.